Hey everyone, it's Denise. Today's my weigh-in day, so let's get right to the weigh-in. Last week I weighed in at 181, and this week I weighed in at 180, so that was a loss of one pound. Yeah, oh my gosh, one pound away from being 179. Like, yeah. So, how did this week go? This week went really good. As you can see, I stayed below 500 calories when I went to bed at night. I actually did not work out as much as I thought I was going to this week. I think Monday and Tuesday I didn't work out at all. Um, but I did work out practically the rest of the week. Except for, I think, one of those days I didn't work out at all. I don't know, something like that. Challenge week 12. Same things as last week, except for um, I put down, refrain from a lots of uh, snacks because like I'll have a snack and then I'm so hungry so I'll go for another snack and I need to stop doing that. I don't know if you guys like look at my channel page, but I wrote down my next mini goal which is to be 170 exactly because I found this piece of paper. Um, I don't remember where I found this at, but um, I get, I'm thinking that this is when I was on uh, Weight Watchers and I first started off after I broke my ankle. And it says um, 6-11-01, I weighed um, 170. So I haven't been 170 since 2001. Also, I'm changing my goal, my goal weight from 160 to between 150 and 140 just because I want to feel good about myself and I don't think when I get to 160 I, I'm going to feel good about myself because I still have a lot of ways to go. So I'm just going to, the range between 150 and 140, wherever I feel comfortable in my body, that's where I'm going to stop or maintain around, you know, that area. So yeah. So this week, I don't even know how I lost because I had a lot of fast food. Um, again, I had three three days of Taco Bell. Yeah, I had Taco Bell Monday and Wednesday for dinner and Friday for dinner. So I've had a lot of Fresco Crunchy Tacos and I'm tired of them. Tuesday we had Jack in the Box. Wednesday was really bad. Like, holy crap. It was horrible. Lunch, we went out to a restaurant. I estimated it to be about 450. I don't know exactly how much that was. The dinner, that's why I had like one Fresco Crunchy Taco for dinner because I wasn't that hungry because of that freaking huge lunch. So, um, and we went to Powell's Candy Store. I got freaking a lot of candy and yeah. It was really bad because I, even though I got like a couple pieces of each candy from, you know, the dispenser things, I was basically on a sugar high. Like, I felt really drunk after eating all that candy. I had like maybe like two pieces of the chocolate covered raisins, two of like um, chocolate covered peanuts, like I had Sour Patch Kids, Mike and Ike's. Um, what else? Like a whole bunch of like sugary stuff. And I tried one of these ice cube chocolate things and I had two pieces of taffy. And I haven't had that much sugar in a long ass time. And I'm not kidding, I felt horrible. Like I was so tired. Like I've never ever felt like that in my life. And Thursday we had KFC. Also, I want to talk about... Um, I did find my measurements since August of last year, and I'll tell you guys how many inches I've lost um, since August, so that's been um, nine months ago. Since August 10th, 2009, um, for my bust, I've lost 5.5 uh, inches, waist, I've lost 7.5 inches, hips, I've lost 6 inches, thighs, I've lost 5 inches, calves, I've lost 2 inches, and ankles, I've lost 1.3 inches. Damn, that, that's a lot, and I didn't realize that until I found this out yesterday. I was like, holy shit, that's a lot. Yeah, I'm, I'm excited. I'm really hoping this week I can be in the 170s by next week. So yeah, I'm going to work really hard this week and cut out as much fast food as possible, even though today was kind of bad. I had Panda Express. I didn't go over my calories, but it's a lot of sodium, so... 
I'm just gonna have to work out hard this week. Very excited for Biggest Loser tomorrow. If you guys watch The Biggest Loser, me and my best friend Amanda, you might spot us in the crowd uh, when they film uh, Coley coming home because we were there. And yeah, it was awesome. So you might see us, spot us in the when they're walking through the crowd there. So keep a lookout for me and my best friend Amanda. We're very excited. Like the Biggest Loser viewing party tomorrow night is going to be off the chain, like holy shit. If you guys want to know more information, if you live uh, in Sonoma County and you want information about the viewing party tomorrow night, message me and I'll tell you some information. Hope you guys are all having a fantastic week so far and I'll talk to you guys all later. Bye!